tanto. Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel, to my new subscribers. My name is Panora Maivuche and to my old subscribers. Thank you for coming back. Deo, I get a So yeah, guys, anyway, my son was busy making noise. You guys already know. You guys already know the struggles of this channel. But anyway, um, how are you guys doing? Hi also and hi also. <laughs> so as you guys can see by the title, it's my graduation guys i am graduating i am super super excited if i'm being honest i think i'm a little bit nervous of the expenses that um graduation is coming with but everyone is on board my sisters my man guys everyone is helping me financially so i'm really really excited and yeah today i'm going to do my nails and probably i'm just crossing my fingers that i'll be able to do my hair i just want to take this hair off wash it and then do weak lines so yeah you guys are going to see all of that um i had already started this vlog guys Gile mall of africa and i got there i was overwhelmed and yeah i'll just I, I did i ended up deleting the footage because i was just so tired and i felt like i didn't know what i was doing um but i kept um the outfits that i tried on and i'm going to show you guys here <music> second one like most of the people like the second one but my sister pastor was like girl that's too plain um so come and visit me we are going to do the whole shebang you're going to look for a proper outfit something that screams graduation so today is the day i hope i'm going to find something guys i'm crossing my fingers but one thing that i'm sure of is that my nails will be done um so yeah let's go guys and get these nails did Bye guys.
guys i know there hasn't been much talking in this vlog so hey guys um we are finally in Bolokwadi, guys a few minutes away from tech drop this man is burning me okay like this man is burning me so yeah guys we are finally in Polokwane. i'm so close to teflua because we are so close to getting this degree <sighs> guys i could scream i could scream but we are in a hotel so let's respect other people getting emotional like i haven't cried guys like it hasn't like properly sank in but i feel like today i'm starting to feel the emotions like the excitement when we were coming here guys like this is the moment like everything that i've been through from first year second year it has come down to this day guys i'm gonna cry i'm gonna cry like last year this time i was watching other people graduate people that i was supposed to graduate with and god was just like my love it's not your turn and <sighs> let me get my tripod son ah let's get comfortable because we are about to be here for a minute so guys like i was just thinking that like <sighs> last year um, i was supposed to graduate like i said guys i feel robbed I, I felt robbed because of that and i'm still trying to like understand that it was god saving me from stuff but sometimes like i just feel like oh my gosh like i was so robbed but i know i was i know it was a nice thing but yeah maybe it's because of how it happened and how it happened guys is that I completed my portfolio right but for some reason guys i saw myself submitting that thing but for some reason um i later found out that i didn't submit it which which to me was just so crazy and wild and how everything happened and how careless i was with that submission um my man always says that um it takes a lot out of me to take apart the things and he always says that like i should just take that as me being careless like i was careless i didn't double check that i sent such an important document and i know he, like he's telling the truth but i'm just a girl i'm just a girl i'm just a girl i'm just a girl and but honestly now that i've gone back to like fixing my relationship with god i just feel like everything happened to a reason and it wasn't my turn you know it wasn't my turn and i'm so glad that it's with me this year i feel like i'm more prepared like i feel like i'm more prepared i feel like um and even now with me graduating without a job that's also something that is like wanting to like bug me but at the, like i'm so strong in my faith that like i just believe i'm strong in my faith guys don't quote me i'm still trying i'm a trying christian but I am strong enough to realize that it's just not my turn. It's not the right time yet for me to get that job. And it's time for me to let go of the dreams that I've always had, um, which was to graduate um, while working. And it's not happening. And yeah, that's, that's another dream crushed. Um, it's not a dream denied. No, I know it's going to happen. I mean, I'm not going to have this opportunity again, like, to get a degree while working, but it's not really bugging me as much as last year, like, to be fair. I'm not going to cut this part. Like, I'm not going to cut this part. Like, I always do, but sometimes I feel like I overshoot and I always cut, like, a lot of parts. But this part is going to be here on my channel. You guys are going to know my true feelings the day before my graduation and like i'm so happy i'm so happy i'm so thankful i hope god sees my heart i know he does <sighs> i hope this chef is also not irritating you guys <laughs> but like i'm just so thankful i'm here with my man the man that was here with me from first year guys like with all 
all we've been through, this man pulls through for me all the time without fail, without thinking twice, guys. Like, I wish this love upon everyone. And, oh my god, guys, like, there's another thing to say about my love, but also I don't want to feel like I'm oversharing, but this man is here with me. Like, I'm here with him and my sister. Unfortunately, my dad who is in hospital and my mom decided to stay behind so now she buys something for me when I come back home. She doesn't want me to come back home to like total silence. Um, I also wanted my son to be here with me so that he can spend more quality time with my son. Like <sighs> my dad, like when when I failed last year He was like at least to pass to one or like one like on a little degree I pass. And you know what? Thinking about it guys, God is so God is such a genius, guys. A really genius because imagine had I graduated last year at that time. My son was only a few months, guys. Like I was able to spend the whole year with my son and to visit with him. To just see him grow, and that's an opportunity that I wasn't ever going to get in my life. So right now, I'm just like, I'm so glad that God chose the graduation opportunity to miss me, for me to be there for my son, to not miss a milestone of my son. I'm so glad. Should we go back again to 2022 to me submitting that portfolio? I would want things to happen exactly how they happened. Just doing something. Guys, guys, I was passed on from my dad. I started this channel, Cafe Steer, guys. Um, but you want to say perfect coincidence. I started this channel the first year. And then now I'm here about to graduate. And a few days before I graduate, I got monetized. Language I got monetized. Good because we are closing this chapter of your degree. And this chapter because we familiar at the same time with this YouTube thing. I don't feel good. I go there to reach the school of yours at this perfect hour. It's not a coincidence. But then I got monetized exactly as I was about to graduate. Guys, can I let you? I guess I'll go to but I'm so excited. Like inside, get a look again at TikTok. Guys, get try your slide, Moki. This looks inappropriate. Mara, you okay, Tale? Get a I'm so excited, Nina. Get a little again, with this much excitement. Get a little again, pretty palace. I'm going to look again, Hey. Yo. And tomorrow I have to wake up at 3 o'clock. 3 guys, 3 a.m. Like how many hours left? I think now it's 9. 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3. 6 hours! And it's not like I'm gonna sleep now and stuff. <laughs> I think I'm going to sleep at around 10. <sighs> guys. I just wanted to let you know that God is good and God shows up. And if you're watching this and you feel like you're missing out, the time will come.
Tell me why you're crying, I can't even beat you When you gave me something, I don't really need you But you knew that already When I found you on the ground, you were darling Now you call me to my yard, uninvited Come you see me on the edge, I'm a lot If the world was dead that happened because i thought i had submitted you guys but it turns out that i hadn't and you know i feel like this whole online schooling thing has robbed us a lot like a lot of us actually so but anyway guys it's something that happened and something that i have to live with and yeah but at the end of the day we are graduating okay and um, it doesn't matter when but the effect of the matter is that we are going to graduate I'm editing this video I'm in bed lying there just thinking about how beautiful this day was how grateful I am for the opportunity and most of all I'm just in so much shock of how God works and how God has been so graceful and loving towards me some of the things um that happened to me i feel like i don't deserve them but this is one thing that i'm sure i deserve i worked so hard guys sleepless nights and so much of doubting myself so many things that happened in my life throughout the five years I've been in Tufliop and everything led to this moment and I'm going to celebrate, I'm going to take it in and I will rejoice because this is my day, this was my day. Anyway, as you guys saw, um, they made a mistake on my name but I had them 
corrected before i went on stage and these are my fellow students they were looking so beautiful my colleagues <laughs> guys yeah god is good i was so happy and i only realized that i was happy day before like throughout i was stressed out about like how the day is gonna go and all of that but i celebrated myself and i'm so happy Bonero. distinction in metabolism for life science educators